Gentle and Lowly, chapter 13, Why the Spirit? The verse is John 14, 16, I will ask the Father and he will give you another helper. The Spirit takes what we read in the Bible and believe on paper about Jesus' heart and moves it from theory to reality, from doctrine to experience. It's one thing as a child to be told your father loves you. You believe him. You take him at his word. But it's another thing, unutterably more real, to be swept up in his embrace, to feel his warmth, to hear his beating heart within his chest, to instantly know the protective grip of his arms. It's one thing to hear he loves you. It's another thing to feel his love. This is the glorious work of the Spirit. And the chapter concludes, the Spirit's role in summary is to turn our postcard apprehension of Christ's great heart of longing affection affection for us into an experience of sitting on the beach, in a lawn chair, drink in hand, enjoying the actual experience. The Spirit does this decisively once and for all at regeneration, but He does this 10,000 times thereafter as we continue through sin folly or boredom to drift from the felt experience of his heart.